patties ready for some simple and delicious stir-fry elk? Nothing easier or tastier than a stir-fry made with wonderful wild game like the elk steak I'll be using today. So why don't I show you how to quickly whip some up? Okay, this is so simple. A little bit of olive oil and a little bit of sea salt. Then I've got elk. You can use venison. You can use antelope. You can use moose. Whatever you've got on hand. But I've also got it in my good bag bag here, which helps a ton when it's in the refrigerator. The mess is all in this bag. And you can use the bag again as well. And I'm going to start cooking my meat here. I'm just browning it. Now I'm going to take a measuring cup and I'm going to add my soy sauce. some cornstarch, and that's what's going to make our sauce thicken, and a little bit of molasses, and a little bit of beef broth, and you just stir this up till it's smooth, and you just add the rest, okay, let's check our meat, okay, now while that's cooking as well, now I'm going to add my water chestnuts, Get a little bit of crunch in there. A little bit of mushrooms. Just a little bit of pea pods, no pea pods. Okay, now that we've got this just about cooked through, I'm going to add my thickening sauce. And we're going to cook this till this thickens. And that is all there is to it. Now a little bit on my right. And slice the slivered almonds. Now there's a great stir fry. Done with delicious elk, no less. Yet another good reason to be pro hunting as far as I'm concerned. And won't you all agree? Hey, for a free copy of today's recipe, for information on the entire line of baked food products, or tips on putting them to delicious use in your own kitchen, go to Winkleman.